This has got to stop. All of this killing is unnecessary. An emotional speech felt by many as they came to honor the life of 19-year-old Morgan State University sophomore Manuel Luis Jr. The census violence is getting out of hand, in my opinion. It's getting too close to home. We got to recommit ourselves to spreading love and, and, and diminishing hate because hate is what happened here. Police say Luis was walking to his car from his off-campus apartment on Lock Raven Boulevard. Two people tried to rob him. He managed to get inside of his vehicle, but before he could drive off, someone fired shots into his car, killing him. Erica Bridgeford with the ceasefire organization began burning sage to help cleanse the area. So when murder happens, there's darkness in that space. And so the sage is helping to cleanse that darkness and to replace it with love and light. A light Luis's friends say will never burn out. He was very driven to do what he got to do. So it was, it inspired me, you know, to become a better person, you know, to become better in everything that I do. I've never met Manny before. A lot of the people who are showing up here this evening have never met Manny before. But we don't have to know him to know that he matters to us. A GoFundMe account has been set up for Manny. That account has raised about $11,000. Now, a ceasefire weekend has been scheduled for August 4th, 5th, and 6th. And organizers say they are hoping for a violence-free weekend. We are live tonight. Karen Campbell, WBAL-TV 11 News.